do not need to tell us twice. Hey everyone, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. We just defeated the first boss and rescued our men, and now we are about to engage the rest of the enemies outside here. Clean shot here, guys. I don't like how we're all bunched up at the door, really. I guess that's my fault for not uh, leading them out into the fray. Yeah, I can't even get around my own guys. Let's just get out here a little bit. Oh, shit. Is that everybody? And can we get our arrows back? Looks dead. Not sure if we're going to encounter any other resistance here. Yeah, we've got guys. Didn't quite finish him. Now, are our guys just going to follow us, or do we need to give them any kind of quick commands? Oh no! What a whiff! I just wanted to see if we can get the arrow that whiffed. Kill you. I did change a few key bindings on my mouse to make it easier to dodge and easier to heavy attack. The alt key for dodge was not an ideal key. I've changed it to one of my mouse keys, and that's working out a lot better. How are we getting inside this building? Shit. Uh, guys, we have company, and they have arrows. And we are out of arrows now. Keep your guard up. <laughs> Whoops, that was not intended. Neither was that. Fun with new key bindings. He's just backing up, that's his play, just to back up slowly. It was working, I guess. That'll do it.
we should probably make sure that we loot everybody. And that we grab all the arrows that we could possibly carry. I'm not sure what our capacity is. I'm sure we could find out. It doesn't really say. Eventually we can upgrade it, it seems. Could just press E to loot. Oh, hello there. <laughs> Anybody else that we forgot? about that this door is also Must be blocked from the other side yeah fair enough someone sees us are they coming up here oh they are coming up here aren't they ballsy bye bye oh they take fall damage Possibly substantial fall damage. Well, I, I don't see a way in from the roof, so that's out. <laughs> oh, I guess we just go in through the window. That's the uh, easy solution there. Oh, we've already cleared this out. Can we not do anything about this? <laughs> Oh, we can. We can break them open after the fact. Probably should have done that earlier so we would have remembered that we had been in here. capacity is on arrows I think we've reached it stretch your wings Sunan I guess we need to worry about these guys on the road are these are these our men looks like they could be Maybe we check out... Uh, no, the tower looks clear. Um, questionable.
Not sure if there's any reason for us to go up here or not. Uh, not really. Grab your oars. The whale road leads us home. Gods, it's about time. Stop yapping and start rowing. Sounds like they're they're ready to leave, so. Take command. Let's see how this works. Uh, open sail. Leave command. Oh, leave command isn't give the leave command, it's literally leave command of the ship. Run up the sail! Uh, I guess we are in control of this. We can hold down Z to go to the quest objective. Rather silent, Eivor. Anything to say for the mess you led us to? We suffered no losses in this fight, and the men who humiliated us are dead. What is that to say? Oh, something like, I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind, boneheaded, and I smell like blood and shit? I like my version better. This is the cinematic camera, apparently. setting up an outpost on that island. Kyotva's men, gnawing at any piece of open land like Same dogs man. worrying a bone. Even with you half in the grave, we can More easily sail. Yes, sail. Okay, I'm trying to figure out how to leave the cinematic ca camera so we could go over here and uh, investigate this island. No, maybe this is the camera angle that we get. Let's take a look at the map here. See, we still have some things that we need to find back on the mainland, it seems. Well, let's head over and, and check out this island for now. If we open our sail, we'll move faster. I feel like we're moving pretty fast already. A new fast travel point has been added to the map. So we could fast travel to places that we've been. That's, that's perfect, actually. Well, apparently we're doing a raid now. Cut my wolves! Trolls take you. That's a lot of guys. I feel like we could do some damage from back here before we enter the fray. Uh, 
bone biter. Okay. Not sure if that's an actual weapon we can equip. Let's find out. Looks like it is. Uh, we go from an attack of 54 to an attack of 69. We'll take that. And then in our offhand... Oh wait, is that a two-hander? Oh, that's a two-handed axe. Yeah, let's play around with that for a little bit. I'm not sure if it's worth giving up that additional damage, but... It could be a lot of fun. Um, what did we, what did we pick up? Oh, read. Sea scouting. Harald's ships come and go and give us no trouble, just as you said. Raven ships are few and show no great strength. The land is ours to take. Um, or so you thought. I kind of want to go back and see if we can get a handle on some of these nodes that we've now uncovered on the map here. Let's figure out how fast travel works. Semi-fast travel. Got a loading screen to contend with. It's not too bad though. So I guess these are our people now? What tiny little child approaches? Me? Ah, many apologies. You are no child, simply a frail and fully grown fool. <laughs> Do we know each other? I know you're a weakling. And you? You need only know my impressive scale and flawless build. Why do you speak to me this way? We are flighting. I've consented to nothing yet. Hm. Fine. Do you wish to fleet against me? Um, I'm not sure. I do. But we can find out. Does he mean like smack talk? I don't understand. Bet. Um... Here's my wager. Small I'm bet? ready for you now. I have no idea what we're doing. Have you ever seen muscles as massive as mine? What you make up in muscles, you're lacking in spine. Oh, we're battle rapping. Like Vikings would More do. More than strength, I can boast that my features are fair. They seem perfectly placed to give children a scare. You're brilliant! Yes! More! Have you ever met someone so witty and quick?
No, you're quite like your arms, just incredibly thick. Brutal. I adore it. <laughs> it's actually kind <laughs> of enjoyable. Rare to find someone with any flighting skill. You deserve every bit of your bet and more. Nice. I'll remember some of those insults. Happy to be of service. Winning flighting duels increases your charisma level, which can unlock special dialogue options in certain situations. Flighting duels can be found uh, somewhere in towns, I guess. All right, well, that was interesting. What else do we have? Well, let's take these in order. What are you be right behind us? Whoops, sorry. Welcome, welcome. Come see what I have. Made with the finest ingredients. Uh, rations? Okay. You've made the right choice. Predator arrows designed to pierce skulls at long range. Use with the predator bow to deal insane headshot damage. You should always have some of these. Literally, it says that. These right. are local. Can I tempt you with something else? I don't want to spend a lot of our money yet. We don't know what we're going to need. I must take my leave. Or so what we're going to want. But it's, it'll be nice to know where we can get things from. I'm not sure exactly what it is we are looking for here. Whatever it is, we are right on top of it. Okay. Annoyed neighbor's note. I cannot sleep because of the digging below us, like rats gnawing at my peace of mind. What do they expect to find down there? They'll feel the sharp end of my axe if it goes on much longer. Uh, below us. How do we get down there? Well, we saw a staircase on the map. I'm wondering if that staircase would lead us down. Okay, sure. Nice. Was that the only way to go down here? Ooh, we gained two skill points for that. Uh, okay. Skills. Wait, node types. Spending skill points on nodes will improve your fighting skills. Stat nodes improve base stats. Main skills unlock fighting moves. Global power. Equipped nodes will increase your power. 
The higher the power, the more prepared you are for the challenges to come. Okay, let's take a look at what we have going on here. We start right in the middle, and we have what looks like three different paths we could go. This one goes into melee. This one goes into stealth, and the other one goes into range damage. Very interesting. Um, where does it lead? So these are passive, just bonuses. 2.3 melee damage, 7 melee resistance. And then we're working towards an ability at the center. Let's check out that ability for each one. Stealth Recon automatically highlights enemies when crouched and undetected. That seems really good. Backstab. Landing a blow directly on an enemy's back will inflict increased damage, I think. I kind of want to see if we can do a sniper build, so maybe we start going down... Uh, the range tree. So we grab some increased health and our range damage has gone up. So we got those skill points um, from finding that secret. Seeing some enemies over here. Oh, he dodged it! Oh, we're screwed, we're so screwed. That's not what we want. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they're not happy. What are the odds that they just know exactly where we're at? Probably not a good idea to try to take them on until they've kind of become disinterested in what's going on. Why are we missing these easy shots? Alright, well, let's go then. I don't know why we're not locking onto these guys. Yeah, not having a lock on right now is not helping me. I don't understand what happened with our lock on button, but it's no longer working for us. I'm not digging this slow ass axe at all, actually. Yeah, the axe thing, uh, this is really slow. Oh gosh, no, no, no. This is not a good look here. I feel like we'd be doing okay if we if we could lock on, and I'll have to check that out in the keybinds. Because this is not working for me. Yeah, that's uh, not good. I don't know what's happening. It's harder to hit these guys when you can't lock onto them. That, that's a fact. All right, I'm gonna check my keybinds and we'll be right back. Well, keybinds were fine. Nothing wrong with the keybinds. Now they're working fine. Now we don't have any health. That's probably not gonna help us. 
Oh, good. It's perfect. I wonder if we'll start back with any health at all. Or where we'll start. Aiming with your bow reveals enemy weak points. Didn't know that. Haven't seen anything like that pop up. We'll have to keep an eye out. Um, okay. Let's run back to the merchant and maybe we buy some more rations, shall we? You there! You look like you could handle yourself in a fight! Eivor Wolfkist, is that you? Is this not the right place? No, it's not. Come, come, don't be shy. These are locally sourced. Yes, you've made the right choice. Can I tempt you with some? I will see you later, friend. Welcome. Now, can we welcome. sell anything to this guy? Come see what I have. Yes, we can. I'm assuming things like cutlery can I tell people this used to be yours and random trinkets. Uh, could just be junk to sell. You be sure to always bring your stuff to me. I'm sure I can find a use for this. I don't know if I should be selling all this stuff, but I'm load. going to anyway. Made with the finest ingredients. Wonderful. No refund. Have you looked at everything I have for sale? I have to go. See you soon. You could handle yourself in a fight. Eivor Wolfkist, is that you? It is Rolf, yeah? We raided with you that one time up on the northern coast. I am flattered you remember. It was the first time Styrbjorn let us raid so far from home. And Sigurd was sure you took more than your fair share. You're still raiding at your age. We need to grab what we can before Harald has his say across Norway. But I only plan them now. I let others do the heavy work. In fact, I'm looking for someone to lead my crew. I would like to help you out, but I have my own crew now. I did not mean you, but I could use your help choosing a leader. I have picked out a few to be tested. Tested? How? If you want to see someone's true character, test it in battle. <laughs> Show me your picks. My crew is gathered down by the docks. Locals mostly. Even a couple of farmers hungry for excitement. How do they compare to me and Sigurd? There is no comparing. You are building some reputation, Eivor. They are talking about you up and down the coast. Good talk or bad? Depends on who you talk to. Mostly good. Do not worry about the bad. No, they should worry about me. <laughs>
So I suppose this would be a sort of side quest. This is my raiding crew, Eivor. What they lack in experience, they make up for in other areas. Together, we will hammer these lumps of meat into men and women of iron. Into raiders. All right. So which from this unlucky lot would lead your crew? See that big brute, Odbjorn? He does not speak much, but he could power a ship by himself. That shield maiden is Ashshield the Keen. Her blade is as quick as her wits. And then, there is Thorgils. Rolf! Who is your friend? Keep your head on the fight or someone will crack it. All right! That one is so thick, he could shatter your shield. But the other men like him. And those are the best of the bunch. So, those three, yeah? I've handled more. You want to fight them all at once? <laughs> Why not? Raids are the stuff of chaos itself. They need a test with no rules. Challenge them, but do not damage them. It was hard enough finding this many. Listen up, you sea slugs. This is Eivor Wolfkist, who has killed more men than you will ever meet. Eivor Wolfkist? I have heard of you. This will be great. You want to lead my crew? You must fight Eivor. Best fighter wins. No killing, no maiming. Other than that, no rules. Understand? So is this going to be a fist fight, I wonder, or...? I am ready! <laughs> fight! A raider needs to be ruthless. I am better than any man here! You have much to learn. Oh! Ouch. Well, that ended really fast. It was an honor beating you. <laughs> right. All right, we'll come back another time and try that again. I don't like that we end up low on health and we now have to use our ration though, that kind of sucks. That worked a little better this time. <sighs> oh no. Oh no, no, no. Let's not go that way then. Oh, the horse intercepted the damn arrow! Oh, this is no good. Come on out here, buddy.
Okay. Well, that worked out. Not going up there, I guess. Jammed. Need to get on the other side. Please be a clear shot. Oh shit. Finish him off! Alright, now we need to figure out how to get into this place. Does not help us. Nor does that. Must be blocked from the other side. Yeah, you'd think maybe we could maybe we could shoot that to break it, but I don't think I have a clear shot at it. Yeah, there's no way from this angle that we that we pull that off. Can't break through any of this stuff. And we're not getting in from up top, so I am a little bit baffled about how we are supposed to get inside of this place. the two doors and if we could undo either door then we could get in but I don't see a way to open either door and I could circle the building a hundred times but it's probably not gonna matter now is it Have a look, Sunan. Well, it sucks to maybe have cleared those guys, but not to be able to get into their stronghold. Um, obviously, I'm missing something pretty huge. I thought maybe we could peer through a window and, and shoot the thing barring the door, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Let's go up here, I guess. Same thing here. I don't think this gets us a clear shot of the door or of anything else.
I'd be interested to know what you guys think about this situation here. But I don't I don't think we're getting in there right now. Seems like it'll be something that's uh, always there. Let's jump back over to the port and we will set sail. Let's go. Run up the sail. now harder and stronger than before no surprise there this war spun on for three generations i hardly expect him to relent your hatred for that man burns bright wolf kissed i could warm my balls on it would you not prefer a pair of sealskin breeches just take care eivor such hatred can make you careless what he did to your father he did to all of us you are not in this fight alone So this is not quick travel when we tell it to follow the route, it's still going to follow the route through the world, we just don't have to control it the whole way there. King Sterbjorn will scold you for setting out against his wishes. Of course he will. Is that not something you worry over? I worry only that our king will not see that I'm right, until it's too late. What about Sigurd? What would he say? If Sigurd were here, he would be sitting beside you, wiping the blood from his axe and smiling into the breeze. So Sigurd's still alive, we're still allied with the king, the one that we saw in the beginning who we gave the bracelet to. And what will you tell our king about this misadventure? Only the truth. That we attacked Kjotve's fortress, killed his men, and weakened his control of this land. Will you mention the part where you lost your crew and were nearly sold as a thrall? Will that be part of your saga? If there's a skull to dare sing that verse, it will be his last song. Reef sail! Make for the dock! We've discovered Fornberg. Ravens returns, and not half dead. We thought we had lost you, Eivor, for good this time. A warm welcome as always, Randri. You look like red and shit. What happened? Nothing to crow about, except to say the men who delayed us are dead. And how are you? Well enough, though I have spent many tiresome days calming the rages of our king. He is not happy with you. I expected as much. And what of Sigurd? Has he returned from his raids? My husband should be home today. The last we heard, he was approaching Stavanger. Good to hear. We have need of his courage. Sigurd will not save you from his father's wrath, Eivor. You should know that by now. Did your raid not go as planned? They rarely go as planned. But we killed many of Kyotr's warriors. And there was this. My father's axe among the dead. Ah. After so many years, you should take it to Gunnar. He will give it back its edge. A good idea. After I see our king. That I do not advise. Not yet. He is meeting with a messenger from the north. I can wait. A cloud hangs over you. Is something wrong? Seeing my father's axe after 17 winters, it... Stirred something in me. A feeling I've not had since... ...the day he was killed. Since the day I got this. 
Memories of past agonies. Of sadness and pain. I should speak with Valka. She could help me make sense of my... feelings. Take your time getting settled. I will see you at the Longhouse. I think you have lost your edge, Eivor. Just like that axe. Maybe Gunnar can help you with both. I will let you know. Eivor! Looking rough you are. Welcome home! Oh, we got two more skill points there. Oh, he doesn't actually want to talk to us. Alright, let's see what's going on. Uh, we've returned to face a foster father's fury. We have to speak to Gunner, the blacksmith. And we have been beset by visions, so we need to seek out Valka's hut. She's going to help us make sense of said visions. Uh, let's see, people... Renvi. Renvi's love for her husband Sigurd takes the same form as most in the Raven Clan know. Admiration from a distance. Given the number of times Sigurd is spent traveling during their arranged marriage, the two are still strangers in many ways. But Renvi is, at her core, a pragmatic woman who knows from her people's harsh history that there are far worse fates than a utilitarian marriage. Dag. As the toughest and strongest of Prince Sigurd's playmates, Dag was certain of his destiny when the prince became king he would be Sigurd's right hand. Then Ivor's village was raised and everything changed. When King Skyborn adopted Ivor, Dag knew things would never be the same with his oldest and best friend, but the fates can turn anyone's luck. Kvote. Long as the list of warriors lost to the bloody clan wars that ravaged, but few will remember with the same fear and loathing as Kvote the Cruel. Kvote's rise to prominence from a relatively insignificant clan was fast and brutal. Some have said he was helped by secret distant allies, but those voices were quickly silenced. He privately wonders whether his son Gorm will prove too weak to take himself, and so is determined to beat the land into submission before his final day. Odin, the Hanged God, Shieldshaker, Greybeard, the Wanderer, are just a few of the many, many names of Odin, the Allfather. Having effectively created the Nine Realms out of the carcass of a dead giant, Odin feels he should be exempt from any binding fate, particularly one that ends in the jaws of a monstrous wolf. His thirst for power through knowledge is unquenchable. He sacrificed an eye for insight and hung himself on the tree drassel in the father, in the father of all near-death experiences. When not acting in his role as chief among the Norse gods, he wanders the mortal realm, often in the form of a bearded old man wearing a cloak, wide hat, and carrying a staff. Classic Odin. Okay, have we met Odin? I don't think we've actually met Odin, but... It seems like he wants to tell us who he is anyway. Treasure? I returned with a boat and a full crew. That is worth more than silver. That but... doesn't count! You need silver! And jewels! <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, bro! How do you know? You never went on a raid! You shut up! Alright, I think we're going to take a break here. And when we come back, we will visit Gunner the Blacksmith and uh, the Seer. Find out if we can learn anything about our visions. And maybe learn how to upgrade our weapons. 